Have you ever seen a sheep yawn? <laughs> that was that. Hello guys, Alex here and welcome to another episode of my father and I renovating this abandoned house and turning it into my dream home. So in the previous episode we poured down the concrete floor in the bedroom and in this episode we will continue pouring down the, f the, the floor in, in the corridor, in the small little corridor and, uh, and then uh, continue taking, uh, taking stuff out of the list of the renovations. So yeah guys, without too much talking, let's, let's get to it, let's go.
and this way we connect between them. Awesome, awesome stuff guys. So as you saw, we already put the plastics, uh, we put the rebar, we wired the rebar up and we pulled, uh, we put those, uh, I don't know how it's called, but uh, to help you with the level. So yeah, now it's ready for concrete. So let's concrete, it's bad boy, let's go.
so we made barricades because we, we have one uh, very curious girl and she likes to to test the quality of stuff so uh, yeah So guys, as you can see, we have a floor at the corridor, amazing stuff. At the start of the day, we didn't have anything, it was a bare floor. And in one day, we put the plastic, we put the rebar and everything, and, and we also poured the floor. So uh, it was an amazing day, we accomplished a lot. Uh, so yeah guys, tomorrow we, we will keep going. So uh, see you tomorrow guys. That's it, the worms were taken care of. Now we can start the day, let's go. So guys, yesterday we poured down the floor of the corridor. It looks amazing. And now we want to focus on this room to prepare it for the floor as well by doing all the dirty works, right? So, uh, so let me show you what, what we need to do here, let's go. So as you guys can see, we don't have any electricity boxes installed yet. So we will be uh, drilling and installing all the electricity boxes in this room. And also, I don't know if you saw the, the video of the plan, but uh, we are planning to do the kitchen in this corner. So we, we already had the, the kitchen guy coming over and marking us uh, where we need to, to place the electricity boxes, where we need to do the, for example, here the sewage and stuff like that. And also we have to, uh, two holes for exhaustion. So he, here we want to have the, the water heater, so uh, uh, we'll need to do a, a hole to the other side uh, to here. And here we have the exhaust of the, exo like because here we want to, to make the, the place where you make the food, for, forgot how it's called, an oven or whatever. So uh, here we want uh, to make the hole for exhaustion as well. So yeah guys, now we, we will be preparing this, this room, we uh, do all the dirty works, so later we can do the floor, so yeah, let's, uh, let's get to it, let's go.
Давай, давай, давай. А бомба. Exactly where we need it. Ah, I love it. So guys, as you can see, initially we pushed two lines up to this wall and one of them being internet and one of them being power and they would uh, go like this, right? So we would uh, remove this stone and put one socket of internet, one socket of power here. But as you can see, if I put it like this, to make it we would, uh, we would need to break this stone, right? To, to make a hole so they can uh, enter. But it would, it would make uh, like an ugly hole. So it wouldn't be much of a problem, but, but to the fact that, uh, that this wall right here, I want to keep it as is. I will not be closing it, right? I, I want to keep it. So I don't want to have like a, an, ugly, an ugly pointed uh, thing like this, you know what I mean? So we were trying to find a different solution and we cap came up with one. So as you already saw, we make this hole to the other side and behind this wall is the is the main electricity uh, box, right? So th this we will have the all the electricity right here. So we make made a hole that goes like that. Where is it? You see? So it will come from here, and this way we will put like the the internet socket right here, and we will not ha will have any ugly tunnels here. And to the power socket that would go, uh, we are planning to, to put this one up to here. And from here we would uh, use the, the, like the, the flexible tunnel, right? And we will just go like uh, between the cracks up to here. So it's wonderful, wonderful solution. And this wall will not have any, any ugly tunnels in it. So yeah, amazing, amazing stuff guys. Let's keep going, let's go. Don't breathe near it, please.
esta bomba. So guys, this is the end of the day and as you saw we almost installed all the electricity boxes that needs to be installed in this room. I'm really stoked about it. Uh, so yeah, now we let it dry a bit until tomorrow, so tomorrow we can uh, push the cables in. So yeah guys, see you tomorrow.
good stuff, good stuff, guys. So guys, that's it. We finished up with the electricity in this room and as you saw we also drilled the two holes for the exhausts. So we did uh, a lot, a lot of things today. But uh, I wanted to quick explain you what, what we did with the electricity. So, uh, so let's come with me, let's go. So let's start with this wall right here. Uh, so as I already explained you, this will be uh, one socket of internet right here and two power sockets right here. Because we initially wanted to, the TV to be on this wall. But then we decided to push uh, the same thing on this wall as well. There will be one internet here and two power sockets here. Because we are not yet sure where we want the TV. It either will be on this wall, on this wall. That, that's why we pushed here. I even if we uh, after that decide to uh, eventually decide to put the TV here, we still ha have the power sockets on, t on this wall as well. You know, it's, it's, it's always better to have more power sockets than less. So let's let's move to this wall right here. <laughs> there is a lot of shenanigans going on here, but uh, let me try to explain you what's what's happening here. <laughs> so let's start with this one right here. This will be a, a power socket that that uh, goes uh, to the to the outside uh, to the outside electricity box as well. So it goes to this box, and this box right here does a lot of wonders for us because it will be the main box for the electricity outside. So eventually uh, when we do the electricity outside and, and see what, what we want to have, the light and everything, we can push all the electricity through this, through this box, uh, like through the floor or through, through the walls. So, so this box right here is very, very important and does a very good job for us. And then we push this tunnel right here. It, it will be the, the, like the light, we put like a light bulb right here. To, to light the outside and this this connects to a switcher inside the house so thi this connects to the switch right here it will be a switch of uh, of the light outside in the living room and as you can see it all goes right here to the box here and he will have all the connect all the connections between all the tunnels so this tunnel uh, goes outside and man i'm telling you to, to do this tunnel right here to, to get to get this tunnel to the other side was a project and a half. I'm telling you, <laughs> it was the craziest thing. But uh, but I'm proud we did it. It, it looks 
looks fantastic. And then we pushed uh, a tunnel through here, which is uh, the, the light of the living room. We are not yet sure where we want it, but we, we, we will push it after we put the roof. We'll push it to the roof, so we, we already have the, the tunnel do, uh, there. And, uh, and, the, and this one right here, I will keep as is, because I, I love the moustaches and I'm gonna keep it. We're going to point it. So in this one, I wanted to, to have as, as less drilling as possible. That's why I did this short tunnel and, and we threw the crack, we went there. That's why I spent like uh, three or four hours trying to, to, get, to get this tunnel through there. Uh, just because uh, I didn't want to drill a lot and, and have ugly tunnels through, through, the, ma through, through, the, through the ruin. So uh, I'd much rather, much rather spend the half day uh, make it like that and, 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 doing, and doing, doing it right and to follow my principles. Uh, and eventually we have, we have a great result. So I'm, I'm very proud of that. Uh, so let's keep going. And, uh, and the last thing is the kitchen. So in the kitchen, we, we never did any, uh, we never installed any electricity boxes. We only pushed, as you can see, the, the, the lines because we go, we're gonna cover it with drywall, right? Because the wall doesn't, uh, don't look uh, very, very sexy. So I'm gonna cover them with drywall. And, uh, and bec because we're gonna cover it with drywall, we don't need to put the, the, the boxes. We just put them on the, on the drywall it, uh, itself, like behind the drywall. But we already have the, the cables. This will be the, for the refrigerator. This, uh, this will be the, the main line for the dishwasher. This one uh, will be for the oven. And uh, the, the last one is like the main for the kitchen, for the, for the sockets we will have. For the for the exhaust and everything, so so this uh, like we already spread everything. We're just gonna close it with drywall, and then we can uh, then we can do the electricity behind the drywall. So yeah. So overall, a very 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 ful fulfilling day. Very like it's it, it's a work you don't see, but but it's a very important work. And and after you you put all the all the sockets and electricity, it's. Uh, it's becoming to look more like a home, more like a house. So, so it, it makes me, it makes me stoked. You, you cannot, uh, like, like seeing it right now, it, it, like my dream is becoming more and more like doing, doing all of kind of stuff, like rebuilding and stuff like that. It's not very much, but after you put the electricity and you see it's like mo modern, mo mo modernized, you know what I mean? So it's, uh, it's becoming look more like a house and, uh, I can I cannot explain the feeling. It's 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 very it's very for fulfilling moment. So uh, so yeah, I'm very proud for that. So guys, this will be the end of the video. And in the next episode, we will be doing the the sewage and the water that needs to be done in the kitchen and connected into into the bathroom. So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next ones.